another day in paradise. It rained a bit last night. So uh, we're gonna see if we can fight, find anything out. This is where we saw the bear last time. So yesterday we were driving on the road here and we passed a bear. He was right here in his branches. He made an escape by those logs there, that angled log went into the forest. Average to small size, I would say. But Big rig is not bringing a fishing rod here. Um, we're walking around looking for black bears and we ran into this beautiful river. I'd love to drop a line in here and check it out, guys. The mosquitoes are just relentless here, but uh, walking through this narrow trail going to the river. We're starting to find the uh, good signs. We will hang around this area. It looks very promising for bears. We found lots of signs. We have, we have, we found some droppings. We have, we found some um, footprints. Um, there's a nice uh, grassy road just up from here. We're just gonna keep following this trail alongside the river. Uh, good signs, really good signs. Bear were here. Just beautiful spots everywhere. I mean, you know when a spot is just right for black bear. Beautiful spot. Since we haven't seen any bears, Daniel is dying to try his 338, 378, whether it be. We are trying some of these uh, older quad trails. Uh, we found signs of a uh, black bear. We found signs of uh, grizzly, but again, we didn't get to see an animal. We did end up seeing this mature bear at the side of the road. It would have been so easy to just park 200 yards down the road, jump in the ditch and shoot him. While perfectly legal, it's just not the type of hunting I like to do. Our bear tags will just have to sit in our pockets until fall when we will have a chance to use them again. <laughs>